a freaking. Uh, I feel like you'd get some traits of the parrot. My toughness. <laughs> Your dad, his Muscles. mom was really tough. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so anyway, Huck, h- how'd it go with Viggy? You guys are finished uh, repairing these ships. Vicky surprised me. Um, I didn't think she uh, knew like uh, what she was talking about. I knew she knew some things, but not most things in here. Yeah, she knew everything. She knew everything. She got everything up up and running in no time. You guys patched up the hu- uh, pups and mm-hmm. the and the Pembroke. Everything's at full health now on your character sheet for the Pembroke. Oh, lovely. Uh, Great. Yes, 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 yes. And yeah, she uh, she kind of ran you rugged. You were struggling to keep up with her. <laughs> I didn't say that, but okay. <laughs> no, you were. Oh, okay. You must have been watching with the DM eyes. <laughs> Any Tulum. Any. Yeah, no, I was. I actually was soaking my feet in ice because of fucking. She, she wore me out. Yeah. So you're just back in your room soaking your feet in ice. Yep. Waiting for you guys to see what uh what kind of yeah I'm things calling. you bought yeah. at the stores. I'm calling them right when I get out of the store. Are you guys heading back now? Yeah, we're heading back. What do right. you? All right. So you call them. So yeah, I come out and I pretty much am like I'm frazzled from this whole experience. I'm just like frazzled, dazzled. I, I, I turn to, I turn to Henry and I say these things are worthless. They're from some they're from some planet called po, Pohan in the middle of nowhere. Let's get this let's get this guy back so we can get some answers out of him. Yep. And and then I pick up I pick up my communicator and I call up Huck Finn and I'm like bring bring hey Huck. He's not paying attention. Yeah, I am. <laughs> yeah, so I called you. I was like, "Yeah, I ring, know." Ring. I mean, how many rings? Let's make it real. Let's <laughs> ring like three times. Ring. Like, give it like three rings, or you know, ring, ring, ring. Yeah. Hey, this is we, Huck, Huck Finn. Hey, we ran into an issue. We had some guy. We had some guy tailing us down here, and uh, he's working for Nick's the Snow Owl. We knocked him out. What? Bringing, yeah, we knocked him out. And we're gonna bring him back for interrogation. What? 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 Oh, a really ugly baby. Wait, what, 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 what? I was just doing research on babies. What do you say about a baby? <laughs> There's some. He was carrying a baby. What? What? What, 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 <laughs> what kind of? You said he's a guy. What kind of? What's? What kind of guy? What is it? What is it? Listen, one of them got away. What is he? And we captured the other one. What, what is he? A marmoset? A lemur. The marmoset was the. The baby. marmoset ran away. Some marmoset <laughs> ran away, but we got the lemur. Wait, the baby ran away. It was actually an old man. So you got so there's no baby. Should I get the fucking pups ready for a baby or not? There's no the baby was an old man. <laughs> All right, get, I I got you. Get back here as soon as possible. All right, so we rush back. And you guys weekend at Bernie's this guy all the way there. Yeah. Yeah. Well, how do we we had to drive there, right? Uh so the space yep. station is shaped like a jellyfish. The dome is on top of the uh, space station, so there's all these like tendrils coming down. Yeah. So you guys like pretty much like go underground somewhere, like a subway, and you kind of just like walk down. Gotcha. And there's like an elevator, a big freight size elevator that takes you to different levels. All right. Yeah. So we're weekend at Bernie's and him the whole way. Yeah. yeah. I'm thinking like um, in Total Recall when. I think it was Total Recall when when Arnold like hits the guy in the plane. He's like, "Don't, uh, don't bother my friend. He's dead tired." Uh, that was in Commando. Oh, dude, oh <laughs> shit, yeah, yeah, it was Commando. Yeah, I was gonna say I know Total Recall like the back of my hand. That wasn't in there. It was Commando. <laughs> it was Commando. I'm sorry. So yeah, that's what we're doing. Okay. Yeah, and I think uh, I think you guys get some weird looks, but you <laughs> answer them but with hey, the wit of Arnold. In the world we're in, I mean, what do, what do you expect? Yeah, everyone's weird looking. Um, yeah, so you guys are back. Uh, to get to the warehouse, <laughs> you have to walk through the office. Oh, shit. <laughs> through what? Okay. Hey, so we, we have to come in through the office. So I'm going to call you again, and I'm going to say. You don't just <laughs> just call me. Don't tell me you're going to call me. This is not realistic. All right. <laughs> so I call you. I call you up. <laughs> ring, ring, ring. Hello. This is Huck Finn. <laughs> just kidding. I know it was you. I'm waiting for you to call me, man. What's going on? Listen, here's the update. We're right outside. We're All gonna, right. We're going to need you to use one of your distractions on on uh, Ollie. Ollie while we sneak through with this, uh, with this Ollie's, prisoner. Ollie, Ollie's, which one's Ollie? Ollie's your <laughs> boss. <laughs> the, the dog? The bulldog? We're gonna, oh, we have to, he's here the whole time? We have well, to, he's in his office. We have to come through the office to get him in the back. Okay. So, okay, I got to distract Ollie. Okay, I got it. Yeah, use your, your yeah. you have that skill. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got the perfect plan. I got the perfect plan. 
Make sure you look on your character sheet. There's a skill there. I know. You might I not, know. You might not. Depending on what he, you do here, you might not need the yeah. skill. I mean, I'm so good no matter what, though. Yeah. You know. So, so like now we're we're waiting like right like right beyond the door mm-hmm. to get in to wait to hear. Huck Finn's distraction. Okay. So you you need him to be distracted so you guys can sneak through. Sneak through. him through. Okay. Yeah. All right. So you're asking ask me what do I do? Do I have to roll or something? Or? Yeah. Ollie's Ollie's. Uh, you go out. You were chilling in the Pembroke, soaking your feet, soaking your fins. Uh, you you look into the office and you see Ollie sitting there. Uh, he's doing some paperwork, some clerical work uh, at his desk. He uh, it is about quitting time, so it looks like he's starting to wrap up. Hey. <laughs> there it is. Ollie. So I was uh, just uh, back in the pumps working on some things, and uh, I was uh, looking at this thing back there, and it reminded me of uh, like a, like an Ollie on a skateboard. Have you ever seen that? The little fish do that from time to time out there on the play field. Anyway, I was wondering if, it, if that oh, had... skateboard. I haven't... You know, I used to skate back in the day. Oh, is that... Is, were your parents skate? I mean, I... <laughs> Yeah, I, I came up. Is that how you got your name? Where did Ollie come from? <laughs> I uh, I came up in the you know my favorite skateboarder used to be Tony Hawk. There it is. <laughs> I knew that was coming. Tony Hawk. Yeah, you know you remember him wait, back from the day. Wait, 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 day. wait. Tony Hawk. Yeah. Wait. His n- Tony Hawk. He was a red-tailed hawk. Tony, the skateboarder Tony Hawk. Yeah. Never heard of him. Okay. Yeah, you, you know, it, it was a long time ago, but, you know, back in my day, I was pretty good. Wow. I, yeah, I mean, your name's Ollie, and I figured, you know, I put the two and two together, and I was like, you must be some kind of, you know, used to be a skater or well, some, I, I, something you know, or like along those lines. I actually was never really good at Ollie's. No? Uh, what, what were you good at, Ollie? Uh, well, <laughs> no pun intended, your name's Ollie. I mean, this whole thing is funny because yeah. your name's Ollie. Yeah, it was a... Uh, I never really got into the whole tricks thing. I pretty much just pushed around and, and longboarded down hills. And then this is where I fucking bust out a skateboard and say, hey, well, I've made this out of stuff, and I was wondering if you could show me anything. And that's how I distract him. Yeah, he gets guys, on the skateboard. Nice. Oh, is that a birdhouse? <laughs> it's actually a generic fish bone. <laughs> <laughs> nice, dude. I never heard of them. I know. And like I said, I totally made it out of scratch. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So now what happens? You guys uh, go skateboarding through the the racks in the warehouse. Oh, whoa, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, I thought I was just kind of trying like ollie flat or something. Yeah, in front of he's. Me, uh, and just, I mean, he's. He, yeah, you're right. He's pushing Mongo. Because don't we want him to stay in this the same place here? No, we need so to get him out of the office. Yeah. So you guys, you oh, guys you go out, out to the, the warehouse. Office. Okay. Okay. But uh, away from where the 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 docking bay is for the Pembroke, you're like out like. In in the in the aisles of the warehouse where all the shit is stored, where all the rocks and minerals and skating back and forth. Yeah, skating okay. Back so I made two skateboards. Actually, I was tricking him. Uh, yeah, you guys. They are, get past. Always distracted. Yeah, I was just tra- All right, that was all just get. Okay. All right, let's sneak him. Let's sneak him into the Pembroke. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, we're sneaking him right in. When you enter the Pembroke, uh, you notice all the all the explosives that Ollie needed needs you guys to transport for him. They all have been loaded into racks. Like they're on the ship. Uh, they're on the ship, yes, okay. and they're they like so they're shaped like kettlebells. Yeah. So they have a handle on the top. Underneath the handle, there's like a big transparent piece <clears throat> of some kind of space age material, and there's a like green and pink pearls inside, like orbs. Mm. The bombs themselves are about the shape of a keg. Okay. So they're pretty big. Yeah. And they have this big handle on top. That's a lot of, uh, or that's a yeah. shaped like a keg? Yeah. yeah. The bomb? Uh-huh. Holy fuck. And it's filled with these orbs, and there's like rows and rows of them. Wow. Okay. That's a lot of fucking ammunition. Ooh. Yeah. Or bombs, I mean, or whatever you want to call it. Explosives. Fucking terrorist, fucking <laughs> terrorist toys. All right, so can we bring uh, this guy into the ship and, like, handcuff what, him to what, something? What's and your plan, and anyway, to up? do with this guy? Am, oh, just, am I with them yet? Uh, you, you're still skating around, Oh, Ollie. okay. <laughs> so, 
I, I mean, I don't then know we can go get Huck. If we can, like, you know, handcuff him somewhere, let's, and then go get Huck. Let's give him the Bufo treatment. You yeah, know, but that, we gave Bufo a lot of leeway. I think yeah. we should give this guy. He you shot feed you. Him, feed him a Milky Way. <laughs> no, yeah, this, I, like I'm, I'm thinking, put him in that same he room. He did make him drop his baby, and it ran away on him. So <laughs> tie him to the bed. You know, like we uh, okay. did. We did that. Kinda, I mean, it's, it's kind of like, yeah. We just that more extreme. Like tie him up for tighter and make yeah, sure he can't this, move around. Because this guy is is like we we know he's a piece of shit. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like. So we're not we're not like gonna be hospitable to him, but we're making sure he is like tied up. Okay. Like chains, whatever. I, I imagine we don't have handcuffs. I mean, I am an ex detective, but yeah, I don't think you do. But I gotta get those. There's back. rope. There's rope and All chains right. and stuff. I'll just say, and then we'll go get you. Go, go get Huck. Let's just say it's Ollie's quitting time. He's going. He's going All home. Right, we're, I'm back in. Uh, he's going home. You got you did your job distracting him. Now he's going back. Now you can go back into the Pembroke. And then I'm like, Vicky's, man. Vicky, I, yeah. Vicky's nowhere to be seen. She must have gone home, too. Good. Uh, Good. Yeah, she was a handle, a handful, a handful, a yeah, handle, so handle, handful, handful. What are you Dipped guys off. trying to do with this guy? Magic. What? We yeah, need to said, find out. Who said magic? <laughs> <laughs> we want to find out everything there is to know about Nix's operation. First thing Wait, I'm, what? I'm, I'm, first thing what I'm operation? doing operation? This, this guy works for the Snow Owl, and they're coming after us. Oh, shit. I, uh, this, oh, fuck, you did say that, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. so the first thing I'm doing is is stripping fuck. this dude and making sure he doesn't have any tracking devices on him. Yeah, he has his laser pistol, and he has a communicator. So so I, I take Sorry. out the, the communicator, and I throw it over to Huck Finn, and I say, disable this. So it can't be tracked. What's a commu? What is it? A communicator? It's different than the one Bufo had. It's just a. Oh, just okay. A, it's, okay. It's a worse version of the thing I that see what Bufo you mean. had. I didn't know. It's okay. just like to talk. Oh, it's just All talk. Right. So yeah. it can't be tracked. Yeah, uh, Huck, you don't think that this has any like tracking capabilities? I just do this and I smash it. That works too. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. It's funny because I thought about smashing it, but then I was like, there might be some valuable information on there. Well, good call. Like, <laughs> and I was Fuck like, it. yep, you know, you were right. There is none. Smash. Okay. He yes, smashed it. Perfect. All right. Um, <laughs> Bam. So it's going great. This guy's awake now. He's. Uh, <laughs> nice. He does not look very happy. He's like, you guys. He's shaking back and forth. He's like, you guys brought me here. Huge mistake. When Nick finds out. What's your name, Buster? Why would I tell you my name? Make a. Because you look like a Buster. That's why you Buster. <laughs> that's what I'm gonna start. This is your name now, bitch. Uh, let's make a. <laughs> make me an intimidate check, everyone. Twenty. Damn, you're rolling good today. Yeah. Ten for me. I'm also the one who shot him. True. So it makes sense. I'd be the most intimidating. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Critical failure. <laughs> um, one from. <laughs> yeah, fucking uh, one. So when you say that Buster thing, he like just spits in your face. Oh great! Does that scared you? <laughs> great. That, of course, something like that would happen. I fucking yeah, mouth I, off, and then I get a one. But when he spits in your face, I shove the barrel of my gun down his mouth. Yeah. No, no, no. And, uh, no, no, no. His gullet. Yeah. <laughs> That's got all yeah, his gullet. gullet. <laughs> yeah, and that works. Um, so. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> That's great. Um, so, is anyone saying anything? Well, then I pull oh, the yeah. gun. I pull the gun out of his mouth so he can actually give us answers. So he's not just like. Arr. What did you? What, like, and what was the question? He Bub asked what his name was. So, Augie. Buster. My name's. Augie. My name's Augie. All these names are hard to remember. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Augie. Augie. Where's home base? Where's home base for Nix? I don't know. I don't know where she's located. She's a he. What she is. What do you think she is? He, his eyes <laughs> glaze over when you say that. <laughs> He's very confused. <laughs> but he looks scared now. All right. How do you have contacts with Nix? Augie. Okay. It's his name. He looked at me when I yelled at him. I believe it. Okay. Listen. Answer his question. Or I might bite my jaws on you. I uh, I work for Nix through Simeon. Who's Simeon? Well, yeah. Come on, we're not Busters, Augustine. You know, that's just the the group I work for. What is that? What is it? Uh, you know, we we dabble in a little bit of everything. Come on, man. Enough with the broad answers. Get I take, a little bit more specific. I take my stun baton and I hold it up to his chest, and it and like I have my finger on the. It's not a stun baton. It's a concussion rod. So oh shit! Like if okay. you, it doesn't shock you. Yeah, it'll like. It'll knock him across the room. <laughs> it, I mean, oh, it would so like cool. it would hurt. Well, he fucking knows that. Yeah. So oh, there I, you go. I put it on ready and I hold it up to his chest mm-hmm. and I say, 
exactly what <laughs> you're him <laughs> yeah. scaring me and i and i say you heard the guy enough with the vague answers you had to have contact with him somehow or how would you pass your information to him when you found us spit it out <laughs> <laughs> just so everyone knows right now everybody has a hand you puppet buster. except for, <laughs> except for me photo. i want to take a boomerang of this sorry <laughs> they are they are being intimidating to the dm with their I'm ready. hand puppets. I'm ready. Get them. The hand puppets definitely help, by the way. They're, I can't believe you found these yeah, together. So sick. <laughs> this is a wolf? A husky. A husky. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, you're a dog. Fuck, I keep forgetting. How about I'm it? A dog. I keep thinking you're a wolf. I don't think we ever talked about this. I'm not a purebred husky, by the way. What? Yeah, I'm part. Uh, what are like, the, bon- the police dogs? What are those? So I can't wait, German like, Shepherd. Yeah, part German those Shepherd. Those dogs are gnarly. I'm part husky. <sighs> In part German Shepherd. I don't ever this is my, this is my fang impression. <laughs> <laughs> nice, this is a pretty good impression. So he's like, uh, yeah, through Simeon. If they know where you guys are, you guys are screwed. Damn, his buddy got away, shit. Wait, 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 back up, back right. up. So they're probably looking for us in the marketplace. So this group is, is after you guys. Can I see if I know anything about Simeon? You can try. All right. I don't. I don't think you know who you're dealing with. They're all the nine. Might make sense if Fang knew. Nope. Fang's a dumb hero. <laughs> <laughs> he oh. got a six. But I mean, I mean I honestly, it, yeah. it makes it makes sense for us not to know because we're questioning the fucking dude, right? But we might have heard of the organization he works for. Yeah. Go ahead. Try. Smart hero. Try. Uh oh. Oh, there it is. What did you get? What is it? That's what it is. That's what I'm getting. It's either a six or a nine. I can't see shit. Damn it. Or either five. Way, either way, bad. you didn't get it. Fuck! This guy's like a low-level dude. Douche. So we we know he doesn't really know anything, except that he knows... That's the vibe you're getting. Okay. All right, let's um leave the room so we're not in the same room as him and then uh-huh. discuss away from him. Okay. Yeah, Separately, it's like, what do you want to do? What do you want to do with this guy? Yeah, what do you guys want to do? Kill him. I re- he, hasn't, he hasn't seen anything where we are yeah, because he was, we, he was unconscious. Oh, yeah. Right. So yeah, but you what, saw how. What, I mean, I, I, you, you want to you you kill, kill him? I guess. Yeah. I mean, I just think that. I mean, you can just leave him in the ship and figure well, out what well, to do with him later. I mean, we're gonna have to tie him up then and hold him captive and let's knock him you out. Got, yeah, so let's, let's knock, knock him unconscious. Him I'm with I'm with Fang. Let's knock him unconscious and bring him somewhere and let him wake up at his own time. So tomorrow and, dr- and like tomorrow leave him somewhere tomorrow you, you guys are supposed to be leaving for Ollie. Okay. Oh man, this is Can we go sticky. knock him unconscious, go rent like a I, room somewhere, <laughs> and then like lock him in there and know he won't be able to get out until tomorrow after we're gone? Do you know what I'm saying? I say we knock him unconscious and just leave him somewhere where he can't get out of that for a while or has to walk forever, and by then we're long gone. How about this, guys? We knock him out and leave him in a dumpster. Like right in <laughs> in the um, marketplace where he was, I think because we, that's that's all the information I'll have. Even if the the marmoset went back to him, hey, we saw them at this marketplace. Then they found the other guy who's oh true, who's who's also at the marketplace, and he'd be like, well, fuck. Okay, they like, might be looking but, for us at the marketplace. So I'm right imagining now. that's true. But, well, I mean, you guys are leaving. He'll like stay alive for a couple of days without food or anything. What do you guys think about just uh, putting him in a spacesuit and sending him out the drift? Just killing him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, uh, the spacesuits have like a, it has like a flashing light, you know. Someone could maybe find just him. Just tie him. Out there. Just tie him to a fucking gravity rope. Let's just dump him in a dumpster somewhere. All right, we'll dump. We're just gonna dump him in no, a dumpster. We, so you guys Some, head back wanna, to town. You wanna, no, 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 no. Don't head back to town. No, we drive far away we, and dump yeah, him. We don't want to go away. anywhere back to as, where. As far away from civilization as we can on this. I mean, I know we're on a space station, right? Yeah. The jellyfish. Like, can All we right, go so, like a remote tendril or something and knock him unconscious? Yeah. Some, Let's just say instead of heading of, totally out of the way, out, no, the opposite direction of the town. Instead of. Dropping him off in a dumpster, you guys just like take him down the elevator deep into the tendril, like down, oh, drop him in like a, f- a broom closet next to some other business, okay, or something like that. Let's do it. Cool. All right. Yeah. So, so it's, it's the next. next day. It's the next day. Uh, Ali uh, comes in the ship and wakes you guys up, and he's like, "All right, you guys ready?" Yeah, I saw you yeah. load us up with explosives. Let's get this shit over with. Yeah, you, already, uh, you not you not how you you not sore at all from yesterday, Ali? Um, well, you know, I'm a little sore. <laughs> 
My knees really can't bend like that, like, <laughs> like they used to. Yeah, me too, just <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> um, so I already, I already put Planet Sigra in your uh, navigation computer. Oh, uh, okay, okay. I, I thought about what you guys were saying before. Yeah. What? Yeah. And, and, what about and? <laughs> I just don't want you to do anything stupid while you're there and get me and my kid into any trouble. Ten four, good buddy. I kind of say it like kind of like. I'm disappointed and kind of sarcastic. And I say, Ollie. <laughs> heart to heart. You can trust me. That's nice. I got you. So uh, what's he saying? All right. Because we bonded yesterday when we skated together. That's true. Uh, so he, you know, he hears me and, you know, I'm more important to him now than you guys. But, you know, <laughs> if you guys, if you guys can, uh, you know, just keep an eye out for anything when you're out there. Just uh, see what's going on there. Do a little intel for me. Listen, Ollie, we wouldn't be helping it out if we weren't looking out for your best interests for you and your daughter. Thank so, yeah. Thanks, guys. Agreed. You're a good guy. Or, you know what I mean. Good, <laughs> good tail. Dog. Good. Tail, tail Everything, sounds like dog. sounds sexual sometimes. You're, you're you're a rad. You're a rad alpha male. Nice tail, alpha male. <laughs> nice tail, alpha male. Me and Ollie, we don't go. We go out and bail. Nah, just kidding. We land that shit. Bolt. <laughs> He's an alpha male. Uh, oh, wow. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, and Planet Segra is in a different solar system, so you're gonna have to make like a light speed jump. So we're we're heading off. Yep, we got MSG with us. Yep, yeah, yep. he's. Yeah, how's he doing, by the way? Uh, he seems fine. He's chilling. For the record, where I'm did thinking... he sleep last night? Oh, he has his own quarters, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, there's right. plenty of room in the... <laughs> well, what's, he gonna, what's he gonna suckle on us while we're sleeping? <laughs> Come on. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I think maybe, like, in the middle of the night when you guys went down to, like, the for a midnight snack and he was... MSG was just looking through the cabinets reading things. <laughs> <laughs> Old habits die hard. Okay, Wait, so... does MSG say that? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> that would be very out of character. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, I, have, I have my, um... I have my, uh guesses about msg so when you're making this uh when you're going to fly light speed you have to fly a certain distance away from a planet because especially such a big gas giant because of the gravitational pull on your ship makes sense so it's going to take you like uh half an hour for you guys to get out of the gravity of the planet uh as you're as you're uh leaving the filer dock and leaving this planet's gravitational field uh your ship is hit by a laser blast. Whoa! Fuck. Oh, no. uh, what the fuck? Uh, well, let's see what if they. The fuck? What is the Pembroke's AC? Uh, defense. Yes. Eight. It's oh, bad. Eight. Why is it so terrible? Uh, yeah, you guys are hit for a bunch of damage. The HP on the Pembroke, by the way, guys, because I'm looking at it here, is 320. Yeah, you guys are hit for 121 damage. Oh my god! Uh, so uh, you are hailed. So, you are hailed immediately uh, by this ship. This ain't good. What do you mean by hailed? Uh, it's calling so your phone. Get, oh, it's calling oh, your, your. It's calling you. Uh, a video call. All right. Well, let's fucking see it. Yeah. He. You pick up, and it's a. Uh, it's a chimpanzee, and he's wearing a military style like cape. He goes, "Listen up! I know who you guys are." It's a video call. Yeah. You roll your eyes like that? <laughs> yeah, and then I say, what's up, limpanzy? <laughs> I, I do roll my eyes like that. Yeah, I just look to the side. I look, I look, at, I look at the other guys, and I'm like, more, like, basically, like, more, more of these freaking dudes. Like, Jesus. Uh, what else does he say? Just, I know who you guys are? He doesn't say uh, anything else? No. And, and, he, and I know what you guys have. We want that hologram device, and we want those mushrooms. For the record, we don't have any mushrooms, right? We just have the device. I thought you filled up backpacks with shit. Yeah, we got... Did we? We take yeah. mushrooms as well? Okay. Yeah, because I was trying to use it to fuck somebody up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't have power, I remember. Okay. Um. So, yeah, we have everything. Get your ass in one of those little ships and fly it over to us. <laughs> and we'll let you guys go. Uh, on your sensors, you can see that their ship is like a giant bird-shaped ship. <laughs> so... Uh, there's this bird called a gannet. It lives near the sea, and it dives uh, to catch its to catch fish. Oh, gannet! And it, gannet! Oh, gannet! Yeah, and when it does that, it like oh, you've tricked me. You were doing a joke. So, do we know if we can outrun this potentially or out firepower it? Uh, it is a much larger ship than yours. Yeah, but do we know if we're faster, even though it's bigger? 
uh, based on the, how aerodynamically cool it is, <laughs> and you guys are just in like a, a mining. Corgi. So we need someone to distract them. That's actually is what you're or saying. Or somebody Max? to fly over with the with the device. Well, we don't yeah. want to give them the device. You know, we have to. We can't outrun them. They have their guns on us. We're at half health on our Pembroke. Uh, yeah, and oh, the, the fucking the, ship's the, fucked up. While you guys right, are motherfucker. Before you said all that in front of the guy <laughs> he goes he goes you guys have 15 minutes and it does does, does it cut out like yeah it cuts out <laughs> okay so yeah you can talk now all right in front of uh jeez i don't think we want to give him the thing dude they imagine how they could just destroy the universe with that thing i know i know they've done some terrible things with it but here's my idea one of us has to fly it over well and there's also no guarantee that they won't just blow your ship up anyway yeah they're gonna right. blast us no matter what here's what i'm thinking all right go on we take out maybe it's like the core components of the thing <laughs> and give it it's like the shell of the device that makes people's you know what i mean so it won't actually do anything but it'll look like they have it and uh we send oh, that over to him. That's so risky, though. What if they have a, a scientist right there? Let's be Listen, like, this isn't the fucking whatever, thing. Guys, they're going to blast us anyways. I mean, I'm, guys, thinking, even, I'm thinking this. We put a homing if, device inside of it. Hide it somewhere inside so we can eventually go back and fuck Nick's up. Yeah. We have to destroy them. You have a ton of explosives. There Let's just is. send over a ship full of explosives and drop it off and get back. A bam! The only problem is uh, none of the, these pups aren't very sophisticated. None of them have like autopilot. So we can't. So we we have to implant a seed. Correct. One of you guys is gonna have to fly the ship over with the explosives in it. I'm the quickest, fastest, and most God most willing to do this. You aren't the quickest, but you're the smartest, and you're the most willing. That's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just staring at the stars right now, going, showing you guys my teeth. Well, that's just how I always look, because I can't help it. Damn it, Hawk Finn, you can't do this. Yeah, let me do it. You guys, listen. You won't understand how to do everything once you get there. And you're going to shut the hello operator up and help me do it, and get it done, and do it well, and do it right. You're either with me or you're with against me, but if you're with me, you're doing it make, to make me do it the best way for everybody to. This is all for the goodness of every of all of us. <sighs> Trust me, this is the best way to do this. What's the plan? And I just, I, I just, just need to know you guys are fully in. I'm in. I'm in. Tell Full, us what your plan is. Fully in. And I need, I, just, to, I need a handshake or something. I need, I need, I need you guys to fucking spit in my face or something. I, tell I me, smash, tell me that you're in, guys. I smashed my concussion rod against the wall and I said, "Damn it, I'm in." What are we doing? <laughs> Follow me. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so what are you doing? Uh, the ship, the pup has... Describe, has like, yeah, describe my pup, atmosphere here. The pup me. has uh, the grappler arm, so you could put a bunch on there. Bunch a of, bunch of explosives. Yeah, yeah, a bunch of the explosives. Yeah. The pup is what? It's the, the smaller ship that you guys yeah. fly. It's shaped like a dog. So head I'm going to go in one ears. of those. We're going to go in the pup. We're going to pack it with uh, like our highly spermicidal fucking explosives. <laughs> the most fucking, fucking, the, the ones that just, just been waiting, just been juicing up and juicing up and juicing up, waiting for this day to explode. Even even carrying these things around, they seem like they're ready to explode. Oh, God. The, Oh, the the yeah. the they're those kinds that if you fucking shake it or if it if it like gets a little sweaty you gotta be careful because it can explode and they're very 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 sensitive very sensitive yeah can you drop off the explosives and get back to us before it blows up yes I can all right of course Listen, I can we'll have we'll have uh, no diggy dog about it <laughs> we'll have Henry on the mass cannon. Just in case something goes wrong. As for me, you know I suck at driving and shooting, <laughs> so I'll just be praying. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, so that's not the. That's not what I want to hear. You know what I want to hear? I want to hear your fucking a darn good prayer. <laughs> Dog Marley. <laughs> this one's for you. One love. <laughs> <laughs> One bone. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys load up. How many explosives is he, is he carrying? Just one on that grappler? I think you could fit a couple. The grappler is like a big Can claw we? hand, so it could like a grab it. I would say you could fit three on the grappling arm. All right. And, uh, you know, these. We load are, them up. Load them up. Um, if you want to rig 
You know how you have the mine detonations? Yeah. Yeah, those those laser trip wires. Yeah. Uh, no, no, no. The uh, mines, you detonate the mines with the we... button on the ship. Yeah, I do yeah. remember that. Yeah. Okay. I gotta fucking put these. So I gotta put the bombs in there and and get out in the in the pup still, right? That's what my the goal yeah, is. Yeah, and uh, that's the goal. And you could set this detonator up on the on the on the explosives. So yes, you okay. could set up one of your mines, like put the mine on the explosives. And I think the so, I, I think the idea is you would fly in, just like use the grappling arm to throw the explosives in there, and then hit the hit the button. And that's that's detonate. our plan. You're gonna go in, what's, explode what's their this, ship. What's this? What's this ship looked like? It looks like that bird I showed you, the one that's diving. That's what it looks like. Yes. Yeah, it's big as fuck. It's big. It's, it's much big bigger than your ship. And strong. I'm trying to think how I'm gonna get in. You know, there's like a a bay for ships to fly in and out of. And they want you to come because has... you're gonna have the the device. Yes, they're waiting for you to drop off the mushrooms, but you're not bringing mushrooms. Oh, Do you oh, think... they think I'm bringing mushrooms. Well, listen, <laughs> should, should we should when we call them back, should we tell the them? Jamming. Listen, the jamming. we're bringing over your device. <laughs> But I don't trust you. Our uh, ship is going to have bombs on it. As Wait, a we're going to tell them that? As a no, contingency plan. Do not plan. tell them. No, we're not going to tell them that. That's a good idea. Do well, not but, tell them they have no, bombs. Okay, what? <laughs> I guess I think not. that's a good <laughs> idea. No, we'll we're see, just gonna... well, see the, the issue is this. They, even <clears> if, we kept, if we kept the device on the ship, they wouldn't blow us up because then they'd blow up the device. I think you could use the grappling arm to like hide the explosives behind its back. Fair enough. Classic, I, I don't, classic move. What, yeah, I, what classic I'm saying thing. is like... What is, okay, what does the grappling arm look like exactly on the ship? It's just an arm on the bottom that can swing around and do all I'm, sorts I'm of things. On, on the bottom of the pup. Yeah. yeah. Imagine if you had to deliver something really important to somebody, but you thought they would kill you. Mm. If you showed up in a bomb vest and you said, hey, I have your package right here, but if you shoot me... I let go of my kill switch and we both die. Mm. Like, that's what I want to do with the ship. I want to say, like... What do you think, Hawk? I want to get out here alive, and I want to I know, like, that as soon as I give you this this device, you're not just going to shoot us, shoot our ship and kill us instantly. I'm looking for that contingency plan, like, to get out alive. They're here. We're, we're here, right? Yep. They see us. They see our ship. They already fucked us up a little bit. Yep, they yeah. shot you. Yeah. Is that like basically what we'll say how it looks like? Yeah, just like that. And they want us to give them mushrooms. And the device from the blast place. And the device from the, the hallucination place. device. Yeah, that, that oh, looks like a coffee oh, machine. Oh, motherfuckers. And um, they, uh, we haven't communicated this yet. Or they have. They just. Uh, they, yeah, they're expecting you to bring, <coughs> bring these mushrooms. Uh, over in 15 minutes it's been longer than that because you guys have been loading the pup uh speaking and they of, said they wouldn't fucking tear us to shreds yes they after the shot they us. promise if you want to live you have to bring this thing over okay well but, listen uh and chris you're offering i go in there with the bombs and i say i got the bombs well i'm, I'm so asking if, give, if as long as they i get to leave safely i won't detonate the bombs that's what we tell them but and, but what we do we do I'm hoping that you can set set up the bombs, like throw the bombs and fly away as fast as you can and get the hell out of there. We can blow them out of the sky. I think if they know we have bombs, they'll be expecting us to throw bombs at them. If they're not, they bomb, right now bombs aren't even on their mind at all. They're just going to think we're driving over there with the thing. And That's before true. they even know anything, their ship will be exploded all to hell. Okay, I like it. By me... He's hiding the bombs. Okay. By me throwing the bombs in the little section, they give me to come in with the pup. Yeah, they expect you to land in there and in you there. Would, you know open your ship up and give them the stuff and get out of there. Do you That's think what that is? Do you think what know. I'm gonna throw in there? And if I just throw it in that part, is gonna be enough to explode this beast, guys? You would know. You're the you're the smart hero. Uh, yeah. How do? Uh. So these explosives, it's it's much. It's guaranteed if I, you know. It's much bigger than anything that you guys would have, uh, that you guys would take out on a normal mission for for just mining. This would be like to split a uh, an asteroid in half. Yeah, it's, it's, oh, it's yeah. kegs. It's huge. Yeah, they're huge. All right. How many kegs can it hold? The the hand. The arm? Three of them. And that's enough. I, yeah, that's gonna mess up that ship. Okay, you don't have to put that in because I want to act like I knew that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so let's send them out. All right. 
All right, so the airlock bursts open. <sighs> Huck Finn is in the pup. He's flying over with the keg, or with the, not keg, <laughs> with the uh, bombs. He's going to party. The bombs hidden behind his back. You approach the ship. Uh, actually, and did you set up, did you set up the uh, detonator? You Do rigged it. up the mine? What's your explosive? It's, my, my demolitions is a three. Do I have to roll? I roll explosive checks for you. Oh, okay, cool. Huck. Yes, sir. You uh, fly close to the ship, and you're outside the loading dock that they're expecting you to fly in. Okay. Are you going to enter, or what's the game plan here? As you're as you're I approaching, as you're approaching, I... you can see a bunch of these guards wearing the same armor that you saw the the guards before wearing when you're at the the military facility. Okay. Nix's laboratory. Okay. So you're you're seeing all these gnarly guards, and they're waiting. And they want me to come. In. So it's like I, I either go in and I and I talk and 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 do a transaction. They're all I, armed. The, they're all armed. Yeah, they're yeah. all visibly armed. Mm -hmm. um, the plan was just to throw the explosives in there, right? Stick to the plan. Yeah. Yeah. No, I think I should do that, right? I think I should just, you know, get as close as I can and throw them in there. So. Okay. D two O max. Yeah, I want you to make a dexterity check. You have a three on that. Yeah. Roll a D two O plus three. Okay. Oh, 20. You roll a 20? You roll a 20, a, a natty. A natty 20. Oh. Pew, pew, pew. Guys, and what happens? Um, so you spin the ship around, revealing all the bombs. You see these guards' faces uh, go from <laughs> looking confident to sheer terror. <laughs> okay. And, uh... <laughs> uh, you do you complete your spin. I think you're like it's almost like a shot like you're throwing a shot put like you're spinning and then like you're gonna wind let, it up. You're winding up and you let you let these bombs loose. So so yeah as as the as they're flying towards the ship. All right. So I got you guys on radio. Yeah. Obviously I wind and then toss them and then yeah. they're, they're, they're slowly floating into the ship. Right? Into the and ship. all the guys are like, yeah, there's one there's one like officer standing right. on the deck and he's the only one where you can see his face. But as he sees what's happening, he looks horrified. OK. Uh, and now. Fang and Henry are sitting in the Pembroke, and they have access to the detonator for these bombs. Oh, I don't. <laughs> yeah, you just did this awesome move and toss them in. Okay, yeah. And then I go, okay, where are you? And then I, I see them go in. I see this little go, and I go, Fang! Fang! Yeah! Listen, if I don't make it out alive, now! <laughs> <laughs> and, and I just I slap my paw against against the button, and I I, I kind of like close my eyes almost, you know. I just like like slap it against it, and I like kind of look away, you know. I can't I can't even look. What happens? And there's just the shot of my big fucking jaws, jeez. And then what happens? <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to jump in there, DM. Uh, yeah. So Fang Fang hits his paw against this button. You see all these terrified guards just get blown against the walls as these three bombs explode. You can't even look at it. It's so bright. Um, and, you know, the ship starts tearing apart and it starts a chain reaction throughout the ship where everything is blowing up. Holy, holy shit, dude. Yeah. Nick is going to be pissed we blew up one of our ships. This chain reaction is much bigger than you thought. The ship just goes up. From Henry and Fang's perspective, it's a huge fireball floating in space. You can't really see what's going on, but uh, you see on your uh, sensors that there is no signal for Huck's ship. Where's Huck? Is there is there just like is there like debris everywhere where you can't see shit? Did we get like blown away? Like uh, like, like does yeah, that your happen in space? Uh, sure. Yeah, let's go for it. <laughs> your ship gets yeah your ship gets rocked a little bit. Yeah, as there's the shock like wave. debris and fire yeah. and fucking uh. Or, what do you call it? What else do you call debris? Other the than ship like, is just know. kind shrapnel. of shrapnel. Yeah. On your sensors, you don't see Huck Finn's pup. Uh, your sensors are indicating that there are ships fleeing the larger ship. It's more of the pelican shaped ships that you saw the guards driving before. Yeah. They're coming your way. God. So I, I, I pick up the communicator and I go, Huck, Huck, you there? Huck. Nothing. Huck, are you there? <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! 
I, I slap both paws on the on the desk and I go, damn it! I assume I'm behind the wheel, right? You are, yeah. yeah. There's no fucking. <laughs> I remember, I'm bad at guns and driving. Bang! I gotta take us out of here. Hyperspeed. I say, I say, damn it! Get us in the hyperspeed. All right, and I'll I'm gonna put us into hyperspeed. And as I'm doing that, I'll turn around and be like, Huck, we're, we'll we'll be back for you if you're alive. We'll keep looking for you. And I don't even respond. I just look to the side because I I know I know in my heart that I think he's gone. As this fireball is getting pulled back towards the planet, uh, and all these other ships are coming towards yours, the Pembroke shoots off into light speed. Thank God. And we're all we're looking at is an empty star field. My boys are safe. Our boys are safe. <laughs> safe. The last thing we see against the star field is Huck Finn's pup slowly drift across the screen with no sign of Huck Finn. McConaughey's trapped in the uh, in the Tesseract. bookshelf behind us. He's like wild right turkey. I communicated Morse code to myself in binary. I'm like, my oh, boys are safe. My oh, boys are safe. All right, so Bubba I'm swimming in the clouds. My <laughs> oh, boys are safe. Bubba, why are we? Uh, why do we have to? Why do we have to end it like this? Why do we have to end this so uh, ambiguously? Well, I know. I am the reason why, you know, you got so many followers on Instagram and... No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm uh, packing up my stuff and I'm going to head out west where real women call me strip. Okay, strip come something. on, Kid Rock. <laughs> just say it like a normal person. <laughs> uh, I'm going I'm, I'm to... I'm driving across country to California. IA. Uh, that's California. And um, on the way, I'm going to be uh, stopping at... Uh, major cities and doing open mics and uh enjoying my good self doing that on the way to california be sure to watch out for me i'm coming to a city near you instagram is at 3u33a (laughs) twitter is austin wayne smith we have a Twitter? Holy shit. Wow, how about that? Yeah, nobody. Move, nobody moving on up, Bubs. Yeah, but nothing's on. I've had it for like two years. I don't I don't go on it ever. Um, but if anyone, uh, yeah. But I you'll be know. back, right? Uh, I'll be back, yeah, for a shout. Well, but uh, I'll be also over there doing my thing. And uh, I'm going to try and like get a podcast going myself, like uh, a traveling podcast kind of deal. Well, I'm going to be like. Pot, like I was talking about earlier, like um, I'm thinking about doing like uh, webisodes of like my journey uh, from here to there, you know. That'd be pretty cool to follow along with. For yeah, sure. uh, yeah. like the uh, the can camera, a GoPro, like just like well, everything. You know what I mean? Have it real simple and just be able to make a little fucking. So will will the adventures of Huck Finn continue? Uh, we'll wait, have that's to <laughs> we'll have to wait and see. Yeah, yeah. I mean, who knows? Isn't that There's some famous? Isn't that some famous book or something? <laughs> no, I don't think so. No. <laughs> wait, that's Huckleberry. That's oh, okay. Huckleberry. Huck and... Yeah, he's got a berry. This is just Huck Finn. It's with the Y, dumbass. Get it right. F Y N N. So the adventures will continue. To be continued. Dot dot dot. Have you ever driven across the country before? Just on a bike. Oh no, only on oh, a yeah. only but, on a fucking ah. Sportster, which is uh, actually very admirable for Wait, you went, because I thought, nobody does I thought that you just, shit. I thought you went south to Florida. No, I that. went to I drove a road all the way to fucking Florida Keys and back in six days with my dad and listen, my old man six days listen, my best that's, friend my that's, best bud that's crazy T.S. But I, I will say at going, A-Town Smith Insta but have you ever gone west in mm-hmm. a vehicle they went to Colorado oh well, then, I rode yeah, out to California oh cool. I mean I rode out to Colorado on the Sportster as well damn four months later I forgot yeah. about that trip I remember like the, I remember the Florida one like but I don't remember that yeah all within a year 
Well, yeah, was great. that with your pops as well? Mm -hmm. Nice. And not a scratch on me. <laughs> How about it, dude? So, well, we wish that's you, all I gotta say. I think, I think we all wish you the best. Uh, in fact, uh, for your sake, I, I hope you never have to come back here and do this <laughs> shitty podcast. Well, you I know, I'm, you thrive I'm, out in California. I'm also, yeah, I'm going to be out there trying to like really do a stand up comedy. And, uh, I really want to, I'm really trying to pursue that as a comedian and, uh, you know, I'm going to join an improv group and, uh, I'm just going to try and, you know, do that as much as I possibly can. Get your fins wet. Get my fins wet out there in Cali, California. Hey, 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 hey. I love you guys, Max. Thank you for doing this. And uh, thank you, man. It's like I this, feel like this know, is such a burden on everyone to do this every week. I'm really, I'm really <laughs> glad you let me, you let me be a part of this and come here and fucking do what I do. And you guys put up with that, and I really, uh, I enjoy it. It's like therapy, and I think one day someone's gonna, oh fuck, some, someone's gonna be like, yo. There's this thing called Galactic Tales. <laughs> Bubba yeah. Smith, the famous actor, is in it. <laughs> oh we should listen God. to all these episodes and then we'll get rich. Or is stand 20 years or, later from now. Or famous. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, I mean, or stand That's what I'm doing. It. Those royalties. Yeah, I'll, I'll do actor for shout. Any last words for, our, for your fans? Um, be nice to people. You never know what kind of day someone else is having, you know? So uh, just think about that. And uh, keep your nose clean. Hallelujah, holla back. <laughs> three, three, three. <laughs>